Hello guys and welcome back to another Clash Royale video. Today we are going to play 2.6 Hawk Cycle and I will try to give you guys some tips on how to use this deck. So let's directly jump into the match and if you haven't subscribed to the channel, subscribe it and I just want to thank everyone for uh, showing all the love and support. So let's do it guys. So we are up against mod and uh, he is uh, placing his knight uh, from the back, so I will just uh, go in with my ice column and I will just use my fireball to get some chip on his uh, executioner and princess tower. Sorry, dagger duchess tower, and uh, I will use my lock. So, this is going to be some kind of lock bait, I think. Yeah, this is actually that and uh, his executioner will get some connection. I will place my ice golem to distract it. So he did manage to get some damage but that's okay guys. And one of his spear gobs will also get the damage. So not the very best start for us but uh, it will work guys. Now we know that uh, this guy is playing log bait so we have to keep that log for his uh, goblin barrel. and. Uh, Let's see if uh, he have some spell or not. So he placed his rascals. And uh, now what we can do is we can just place our cannon. I don't think this guy have any wind condition other than a goblin barrel. Let's see. I will just place my ice golem like this. And that rascal girl will get three shots and that was insane. After the nerf, uh, Dagger Duchess uh, deals a uh, very less damage like previously and I think we can get some connection using our skellies. Let's hope for it guys. I think he don't have any spell for it now. Okay, so it's done guys. I think he loses this tower. So that was an easy one. Let's get ready with the defense guys. Uh, let's go in with our hog. Let's pressure him. Let's see what he will do. So he placed his uh, goblin gang and a knight. I will just farm over here to get uh, a lot of things. Let's log this back guys and uh, let's place our ice golem. This is going to kite his knight as well. So that will help us in uh, defense. Okay, let's uh, get ready with the cannon guys. Okay, let's uh, fireball this. So we will not get the rascal girl, but that's okay guys. Let's uh, place our ice golem. And on the right side is the real goblin barrel. Let's go in with our hog. So that's it guys, GG's and let's move on to the next one. So we are up against Zavichi. So good luck to him and uh, we have our hog in the starting hand. Let's go in with it guys. Let's see what he have for us. So he placed his uh, prince from the back and uh, I think this is going to be a giant deck. Oh, it's not guys. Let's place our skellies and let's get ready with the cannon on the defense. Nice zap from him and his prince will almost take out our uh, cannon. And I think this uh, ram will still get the connection as uh, we all know that uh, after the buff it can get the charge from a very less distance let's pressure him using our hog i don't think he have his uh, prince but this guy is also running paka and uh, after the nerf uh, dagger duchess can't take out our hog completely even with the paka and i think now we have to defend this uh, goblin machine and this is going to be annoying one guys but after the nerf uh, it can be manageable Okay, so uh, this was not the very bad defense. It was really nice and uh, his demolisher will take out my musketeer. But that's okay. Now we can go in with our hog and spirit. Let's see what he will do. And uh, he will place his wizard. We can fireball this, but uh, I don't want to waste my elixir right now. Let's wait, guys. One thing we can do is uh, that we can just log back this wizard to... Uh, take out some of the health and you can see dagger duchess can take care of it after that let's place our skellies and he used his uh, zap 
really nicely. He did manage to predict our two skellies, but that's okay. Nice defense for us. Now let's go in with our hog. I think he's back to his backer. Okay, so he is indeed, and he placed his uh, goblin curse. The spell can be annoying against uh, graveyard, and graveyard is like converted into goblins. And that's the most annoying part of this spell. Let's uh, just kite this one and let's go in with Hog. But I'm, I think that Hog is a really bad one. And we have to stop this prince from getting the connection on top of our musketeer. But uh, his prince will get some damage. But that's okay guys. Let's place our musketeer. Let's lock this one back. And musketeer will take care of these both. And now what we can do is that we can pressure him using our hog and spirit. Let's go in with our hog. Let's see what he will do. I think our hog will be able to take out this tower. So that's it guys. GG's and let's move on to the next one. So we are on the match guys and it's a Sahara Aziz. And let's start with skellies from the back. Let's go in with our hog guys and let's try to get some damage. So this guy is running Royal Recruits and I think this is going to be some split lane deck. Let's see what this guy have. So Dark Prince as well. Musketeer will have a nice value with the 4 elixir and uh, let's place our skelly over here. I think we should put down our cannon. So that's uh, not the best defense but that's okay guys. We did manage to stop a lot of damage. Onto our dagger that's a tower. Let's go in with our hog. Let's pressure him. He don't have his cards that he want to place. And uh, lots of cards are on the level. We can lock this back and finish off this archers. Let's do it guys. And uh, now what we can do is that we can just uh, wait for elixir to fill. And uh, after that we can have a push guys. So this guy is uh, running a uh, princess tower so we can go in with our ice spirit and have a nice connection and if we can get the evo spirit connection then that's uh, really great guys let's place our musketeer from the back and uh, i will try to distract this using my ice golem let's place our cannon also just to get the king tower activation let's place our skellies over here Skellies will like things start to multiply and you can see we did manage to catch that bandit as well so a uh, nice defense by Our ice golem and spirit I think our hog will manage to get a lot of damage. Let's hope for it and it will get one more shot. I think That's really great and we did manage to get four shots So I was not expecting that but that's a huge one guys. Let's place our cannon and Let's get ready with uh, another spirit. Okay, let's lock this back. Nice lock for us. And his firecracker will get the one shot. I will just ignore that, guys. As we have already won this match. Let's see what he will do. He is leaking a lot of elixir. And uh, he is not doing anything. So I think he just left the match. And now what we can do is that we can just... Uh, Go in with Hog and Ice Golem to just finish off this game. Let's put down our skellies. I think that skellies were just a waste. But I was wrong, guys. You can see skellies are getting multiplied. And now what we can do is that we can just log this out and finish off the game. So that's it. GG. And thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Bye. Take care.